a biographical retrospective of Franz Mark, written by Katie Hagler. In the beginning, Franz Mark was born on February 8, 1880. He was born in Munich, which was the capital of the kingdom of Bavara at the time. He was introduced to art by his father, Willem Mark, who painted landscapes professionally. He wanted to follow in his brother's footsteps when it came time for him to go to school, studying studying theology, but two short years later, he decided to enroll in Mun Munich University to study the arts. He was unable to enroll until he served in the military for at least a year. After he served, he decided to go to the Academy of Fine Arts in Munich, which was short-lived with him leaving in 1903. Although he left school, he still spent much of his time painting. He was one of the founders of the German Expressionism era. He tended to paint animals with unusual colors like the large blue horses, the monkey, the yellow cow, and many more. Franz Mark was drafted into the Imperial German Army at the beginning of World War I as a cavalryman. In 1916, he had gone from cavalryman to camouflage. Using his artistic abilities, he would paint on canvas to hide artillery from the enemy. After the German army had mobilized, the German government wanted to send any artists back home for their own safety. While they were getting the paperwork ready and to send them home, Franz Mark was killed in action two years later, on March 4, 1916, at the Battle of Verdun, before he received his letter to return home. In 1930, he was an idol for the Nazis being called the degenerate artist for their suppression of modern art. His family's home is now the Franz Mark Museum, housing him and other contemporary artists' work in it. His latest piece of art that was sold was Grazing Horses 3, which sold for $24,376,119.